I had once read a screenplay called The Skin Game, which had never been made, been bought by Warner Brothers, never been made. And I said, I, I said to Warner Brothers, because we made the deal with NBC, then we went to Warner's to make the stuff. I said to Warner's, listen, there's a screenplay called The Skin Game. I want to make it as a movie with Garner and some actor, some other actor. And they said, okay. And it's a wonderful script about two con men from New Jersey, one black, one white. They go, they go south to little towns. This is early on in the, like, I guess in the Civil War days. Anyway, they go south to the little towns and in every little town, Garner sells the black friend that he's got as a slave, pretend slave. This is his slave, and he's auctioning him off. Then they take the money and run out of town, go to another town. They make a fortune. They go from town to town, and Garner sells the black guy in every town. And meanwhile, they're two equally... Uh, not very legitimate con men, but that we didn't have a, a black actor. I had been to the taper, to the Mark Taper Forum, and I had seen a play in which a black man played the part of Lumumba, a president of uh, one of the African countries, and his name was Lou Gossett. And I had never seen him before, and I don't know that he had ever done a film. But I said to Warner Brothers and to Garner, I want to test this man, Lou Gossett, because I think he's great, and I think he'd be wonderful for Skin Game. So sure enough, we tested him with Garner in the part, and he was good, and we hired him, and we made the movie, and it was good. Paul Bogart directed it. Did you produce that, or were you certain? Yeah, no, I was executive producer of it. Yes. And Peter Stone, who wrote it and did a great job, when he saw in the paper that Garner was going to do it, he said, oh, my God, that's a disaster. It'll be terrible. I don't want my name on it. He went to the Writers Guild, and he got them to change he got them to tell Warners that it was going to that the writer was going to be called. He he made up a name. When the movie was finished, it was just wonderful. When the movie was finished, he saw it. I mean, before it was released, and he said, "Oh, I want my name on it." And I said, "Too bad. Too bad. Over. You've done it. I'm not going to put your name on it." And I didn't. 